I feel like it's still somewhat of a similar, um, uh, somewhat of a similar game plan. Yeah. You know, Wolf uh, is able to still take, you know, take space progressively, but yeah. also, you know, is able to threaten at a distance oh, with, no. of course, the blaster. Which, you know, as we were saying before, Helper is a player who really just likes to let you dig your own grave. So if Raimi is able to take a little more space for himself with the blaster, mm -hmm. and of course also threaten Helper's own zoning with the, the reflector, might be in a better position than he would be with Lucina. Yeah, absolutely. I feel Wolf ha does a great job of... of really converting a loft off of, you know, just his fair is fantastic. Nair, the grab the grabs. Um, it's very Wolf is such a fun character for me. I really love Wolf. Actually character Ooh, I enjoy playing a lot. Jump. Oh yeah. Alright. Rami makes it back. Yeah, help her going for the uh, the counter potentially uh, expecting the wolf flash to mm. come out. Now, I do also want to point out that while Rami does uh, kind of lessen his risk on stage, he is trading that for more risk off stage. Yes, Whereas, very good Lucina point. has a pretty safe recovery. Wolf suffers from the kind of eternal spacey problem, which is please edge guard me, as right. Helper has just shown us with the, the F tilt. Yeah, Helper did a great job there exploiting Wolf's recovery. Yeah, like you said. What? Uh, oh. Well, can we, can we get an instant replay on that? The back hit of down smash, the left hit, hit of down smash sent him right. I'm mad about it. Oh, I didn't even realize. Dang, that's, that's nutty. All right, well, anyway, getting back into the game, uh, sitting at even percents, not a whole lot of uh, explosive gameplay happening thus far. Helper waiting until we were done with the instant replay to start getting some fair loops going. So very considerate by Helper. That's the that's <laughs> that, the House of 3000 difference. Very nice. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> One thing that is, you know, the like you said, the drawback of Wolf having a pretty weak recovery. His kill power, though, is just so intense. Oh, absolutely. But right now, we're seeing Rami rely a lot on the blaster here in neutral, just trying to trying to keep that space and trying to threaten Helper into losing to his own game plan, kind of. And yeah. right there, being able to bait Helper into, into that dash attack. I definitely like this adjustment by Rami. Don't be shy, you know? You got the blaster, use it. Absolutely. I mean, especially with the way that Helper loves throwing out spells. Yeah. Just throw out some projectiles of your own. And there, once again, a very kind of Sora-like interaction where it's like, it's almost like the Faraga just throwing the one which, you know, puts you in just enough hit stun to make you uncomfortable and mm. just throwing out the dash attack, which both of their both of these characters' dash attacks, very good at killing, as is yeah. Wolf's up smash. They're taking Helper's second stock and now putting Rami in a stock lead. Almost get getting the patented Sora conversion there off of Nair one. But let's see if Helper could get this stocked off quick before Wolf tacks on some damage. And damage Wolf can tack on. Yeah, and I mean, these point blank blasters are really putting a wrench into Helper's yeah. plan because as good as Sora's movement is, he really does not have great horizontal acceleration. And he does have the Keyblade, but it's a little stubbier than most swords right. in the game. So, you know, trying to find his way in. That time, though, with the up throw, almost 200% on Rami, but only 26% uh, percent extra credit on Helper. So definitely we're back into an even game. You saw Rami let out a huge sigh, and definitely rightly so, because he was hoping to tack on a bit more damage before getting down to his last stock. But Wolf doing a good job. But now Helper trying to Get some more conversions going. Wow, I'm surprised that blaster hit. Blaster's such a good move. He like swings it yeah. upward after he after he shoots it. Yeah, Helper kinda, you know, getting defeated by his own game plan. We saw Helper 
trying to enact that ledge play that we typically see from him. What a oh. read on the mash by Helper. That felt like Rami's game to win. Yeah. Stealing it away from Rami. House of 3000's Helper. That was very nice. Scripted, done. rigged. Yeah, I know. But yeah, he definitely did a good job of reading the mash. Right, and, and I feel like if he didn't DI straight up, he could have potentially lived it, but yeah, I mean, you weren't ready for that. You know, you were just trying to get out of that ice. Uh, but good F-Telt there by Helper to get that stock. I hate that move. Oh man, yeah. That's so dumb. Covers it a lot. But yeah, in very close game one. Let's see how the match progresses. I, I feel like Rami feels a little bit like that game was very firmly in their grasp, but let's see what happens now. Yeah, back to I the think, same stage. Yeah, I think uh, that is exactly why we're going to be seeing uh, TNC back for game two. Rami wanted to be the change that he sees in the world. <laughs> It's hard to change anything. We're just getting chopped up by these Keyblade loops. Yeah, but I mean, like we were saying, Remy really had like all of the momentum at the end yeah. of game one, and it was just kind of stolen from him. So I, I want to see more of that momentum in into game two. Yeah, I wonder if Rami this game starting out. Yeah, you see a lot more lasers coming out this first stock. The last game, Rami was just trying to kind of get into Sora's face, throw out those aerials, and try to convert a lot of damage. But now, I'm loving the patience here, but hard to deal with that move by Sora. Oh, the up smash coming again? Yeah, and wow. another uh, Blizzaga into up smash. And we put in Helper into a pretty comfortable stock lead, only 82%. That big floaty double jump, there's no way Wolf's contesting you there. Yeah, 100%. A potential re-grab here. Does get the parry on the side B, but not able to follow up on it. Dash attack still not going to be doing the trick just yet. F-tilt? Oh, all right. I feel like it's probably really hard to catch those F-tilts against Sora, especially with how active the up B is. Yeah, I mean, the the active nature of the up B, and as well, of course, you know, Helper has so many mix-ups out mm. of the, the up B yeah. uh, on recovery, just because, I mean, you know, he can throw out the side Bs, he can throw out, like, a spell or a anything like that but that time though catching the get up attack i think and yep. rami now in uh even stocks yeah nicely done there by rami all right trying to find his way now out of the corner but an ill-timed blaster i think one of the the first ones that was really like hard punished from helper almost right. converting into the stock yeah helper looking really strong Ooh. in this in this game too now, Rami kind of with his back at the wall. Yeah. Now at one stock, while Helper sitting at 29 on his second stock. Rami's really got to start putting the momentum back into his favor. I wonder if the wolf choice was solely due to Rami not liking the Sora matchup as Lucina. Potentially. But oh, you're so dead. What percent was he at when he wolf flashed? It looked like 50. Yeah, we'll yes. get that. It looks like we're going to get that replay soon. You're 58. Dead. Wow. Well, excellent job by Helper. Really looking super dominant and continuing their winner's run. I feel like this is a really solid run by Helper at this Zeno. Yeah. Helper's been doing uh, fantastic as of late. Really been leveling up with the Sora. I feel like the Sora meta is pushing. It's coming. Kameme <laughs> killing coming. in Japan right now. Um, I'm very curious to see how the end of the year pans out with all these big tournaments we got coming up mm -hmm. and seeing more characters like Sora get more representation and I mean that's just oh my god what do you do as Wolf when you're trying to Wolf Flash uh, back to stage don't, just try, get... don't try to hit the boy yeah oh true true I mean we did see Helper go for that exact same setup of like yeah. trying to bait out the Wolf Flash uh, in game one. Yeah, but uh, then the F-Tilt as well, hitting under you know under the stage, if like he actually, if w the wolf spaces their recovery just as good, it could still get hit. Yeah, yeah. I mean, at the end of the day, it